In this video, I'm going to show you how to download your Keller Williams logo. First, you want to go to mykw.kw.com and you're going to come up to the word marketing in the black bar at the top of the screen. And you're going to choose logos and graphics. Now, I will tell you here, there is the actual style guide that you can click here to access. This will download a PDF that tells you some of the style requirements from Keller Williams. Now down below, you're going to find all the different logos. Now the difference between print and web is the way that it's been optimized. So you can choose if you want it to be printed onto a material or the web version. I will tell you I've used just the print version for everything, yet you're welcome to use whichever one you want. And the differences are full color means that you're going to have the color on both the KW and the uh, Keller Williams portion. Reversed full color means you're going to have color on the KW and then it will be white text for the Keller Williams. Grayscale obviously means it's black text for Keller Williams and gray KW. And then you're going to see reversed, reverse print, one color. What these things mean is even though this is a red background, the text and the logo is all white in this one. This one is white with a little bit of gray. This one is white with the gray Keller Williams and dark background. So don't worry about the actual physical background. You don't get those. You just get the logo that's displaying here. Now, if you wanted to download one of these, and there's the Keller Williams Realty logo, Keller Williams Real Estate, there's the KW logos, Keller Williams, all the different logos here. You would just simply download one of these. I'll download the print one. It'll be in a zip file. And when you're looking at these files, here's what they are. So when you're looking here, the difference is EPS is for your um, Photoshop if you need it into those programs. Your main reasons you need this is a JPEG, is a white background, and then the text or logo. The PNG, though, is where the background's invisible so that you can put the branding on top of a file. Now, if you're looking for one for your Market Center, you can also click here to access your Market Center's logo. And you would just start typing in your market center's number. So here's my market center, and I can preview it here and then download a version of it right from the system. So it's your ability to pull up the different logos and be able to download them right from the system. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like, leave me any comments, and follow me on KW Connect today.